Hello everyone, welcome back to Europa Park where I'm playing with Romani. Let's go on with the game. So last time what we did is that we managed to take these settlements in northern Italy. And this is really really great. Now the next time we're gonna do we're gonna try to capture this settlement right here, which is very poor defend as you can see, and we're already besieging it. In fact, let's see if we can actually attack it right now. No, we're gonna just attack it next turn. Then we're gonna try to expand farther into France. We're gonna try to take Massilia, although if we can take Massilia then uh, the Edwy tribes will definitely attack us. In fact, they will attack us anyway because we have captured Mediolano. Now let's see what do we have here: heavy tax rate and many other things. So let's just go on with the game and let's see what's going to happen next turn. We're going to also make a new army and we're going to try to send it towards Mediolanum right here, no, towards uh, Massilia. Then we're going to expand farther into France, into Gaul, Gallic territory or something like that. So let's go on with the game and see what's going on. I think that if we're gonna take Dalminio and Epiros will attack us, but I don't really care much, so let's just attack them right now. We also have a lot of money. We're recruiting new troops. Marriage celebration. Here we have also a huge art. Alright, so time for us to attack here. No time to lose. Not at all. There is a great general here. This is what he has. Some Illyrian spearmen. We're gonna take it 100%. Let us offer prayers to the gods for victory! Okay. Let's see how or where will we attack. Let's try to attack here, this gate. Then a full large scale attack right here in the middle. Time to start a battle. Let's send our slingers in action. We really have a lot of them. This is a lot of slingers. We also have a lot of cavalry here. I think I should take care of this cavalry. Maybe I should just train it because they have they have fought a lot and they have lost a lot of men. Yeah, we could also send these guys forward already. There's these guys here. What is this guys? Let's just send them forward and wait a minute, I forgot about these troops here. <coughs> Do they have some cavalry? Doesn't really seem so. Oh they are already firing. But our guys are firing as well. And we're gonna start taking huge casualties here, I think. Many of them are falling. What is that general?
That's it. I think we're we're just in. We're just in the game. So they have also some Hellenic spear slingers that have taken so much casualties. Fingers are being exterminated. All right, so I think we could we, we could already send some troops inside. But they are still patrolling with some troops here. What's left of them, of course, since they are anyway decimated. They are broken up there as well. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, they have brought up some troops here, but they're gonna be exterminated as well. So our guys will just throw their arrows at them. Just two of them have fallen. Doesn't matter. Okay, so I just think it's time to march in with highest speed. Just in. I think they're gonna attack us, but doesn't really matter. Actually, what they have here is only one Illyrian Costal Levis. I think they're gonna attack very soon. Here we can also get in. I think this guy was just gonna retreat. Yeah, just I thought. Almost destroyed. They are just destroyed. Right, so right now I think we could just move forward. There are a lot of troops there. Let's attack these guys. I guess we'll flee as well.
so I just think that they might be exterminated right now because I think that not having anything now. Okay, here we managed to break them. All that they have is that they are general, and oh, they do have some cavalry and some Illyrian spearmen, or at least what's left of them. This guy is gonna be completely destroyed. Just to watch how this is gonna happen. Perfect, just perfect. They should just wait here for the time being. Now these guys are also arriving, and it's a lot of them, including this Sunlight Infantry. even furthermore and yeah we still have these guys here they should also arrive like right here what is this guys right there sure that oh, this is their general right here okay they're gonna attack very soon with them let's get closer here let's get closer then try to bring our skirmishers although oh, I don't think they can do it difference in this game. Alright, let's advance with these guys right there. Very soon they're gonna attack, but it's just gonna give them some time there. We have anyway a lot of time. There's no way we're gonna lose this better than we Let's get even closer. And if we're gonna see them that they will attack then I gotta stop my troops. Oh yes. We have the cavalry in the back. Oh, they are attacking with the general. Oh, this is gonna be a huge mistake. Okay, time to give a huge charge here. completely take out the general, their general, which have already lost 50 men. <coughs> Many of their cavalry has been brought down, only 6 of them remain. 
Yeah, they have absolutely no chance at all against this Winter Coast Cavalry. Let's move forward with them. Someone is firing. Oh, it's our slingers, I think, that they are. No, no doesn't seem so. And they just seem to be completely destroyed here. And this army was really a great, great army. There was no way that they would win it. It was absolutely impossible for them to win it. And their greatest general has fallen. No. They are simply completely destroyed. What's his name? Chianatis. Yeah, they are just annihilated. Let's give a last charge before they're gonna be completely destroyed. And I just think that it's gonna be all over. It was a very, very easy victory for the Romans. I gained no experience of this because it was simple. It was too, uh, too much a simple battle. Dalminion 260 BC. So we took another town. I think is very, very important uh, economically, to say the least. It's a very important economic region, and I just think that the Epirotes will attack very, very soon here. So that would be okay because we could, we, we would have the chance to open a new front in uh, in Greece, which will provide us an opportunity to to take some Greek uh, towns that will be I have to say extremely important if this if this is going to happen. So what do we have here? Can we recruit something? No, that means we should destroy this barbarian barracks. Brilliant. Barbarian barracks. Yeah, let's repair these things. Yeah. Also build this thing here. Which will provide more public order. Now, if the Epros will attack, they're already making this Hellenic Supreme, which is a very heavy infantry, but we have also a great, great army here, a very important army. Yeah, they also have a great great army here. Yeah, with this Hellenic Levy Phalanx, yeah, Illyrian Levy Spearman. Which this is this are very poor. This Hellenic slingers and some hippies, whatever. If like I said, if they're gonna attack, it's gonna be difficult. Let's see with whom they are at war here, the Epirotes. Or Epeiros. Yeah, they have a lot of enemies as you can see. Pontos, Carthage, Macedonia, Koinon, Helenon. I don't think they're gonna attack us just now. But if they can manage to conquer the whole Greece, they're gonna definitely attack us with a lot of armies, so we're gonna have to be careful. Like I said, it would open a new front in Greece and I could easily be able to perhaps invade them right here and capture some coastal towns that'll be so important. We'll see about that anyway. Now, like I said, let's get back to Massilia and let's send our spy in there. Right. This is where he will have to arrive. Your Honor. 41 years old. A very good spy. Good, so this is what we have now. Let's see, let's try to build a new army here. This is what we have here. Yeah. Recruiting some more um, French pieces is going to be also important, and we're building up a new thing here in Rome. It's going to also be very, very good. So this is going to be it now. Like I said, I'm putting up a new army. Then let's go on with the game to the next turn. We managed to meet someone here. Not sure who these guys are. Perhaps they're gonna leave. Yeah, just as I thought. But I think they're gonna go after them. I really wanna see who they are. I think they are Bactrians, if I'm not wrong about that. Yeah, they are definitely Bactrians. I'm just gonna try to open a new trade route with them. There you go. Patrocles Marakandaios. This is a Greek general. Bactrian general. I shall speak with them at once. Let's make the trade rights first. Some map information. Accepted. 
an alliance would not benefit whatever. Good, so here are the slow scenes, here are the backtracks, you have expended so much, here must be Sauro Mati or maybe no, uh, someone else like Sakarauke or something. So yeah, let's just go into backtrack territories, you can, we're gonna meet some backtrack army, backtrack troops here actually. Without delay, move depleted, sir. Your honor. Okay, so we have a little bit more money now, which is actually so important. Let's see what exactly we have here. Let's build a temple here, first of all. Of yeah, a temple of Vesta. Let's build what this is gonna bring. Okay, then we should build this thing here. That's what is here. In order to be able to recruit some. No, we can also build a general, or recruit a general here, but we don't have enough population here. We also don't have enough population. I think I would build here a lightly Romanized province. But, yeah, let's actually build it right now. I mean, why not there? These are very simple buildings that should be built right away. Yeah, we're gonna be soon able to recruit some troops here as well. But we're just gonna have to wait first. Right, so let's recruit up some new troops if we can from somewhere. I think here is where we can recruit some troops. Yeah, let's build this one too. And... We also don't have enough population here, but I would still like to recruit another unit. So what can we do here? Public order is already big don't actually need anything. Yeah, this is gonna be okay. As far as I can see, the Carthaginians are still not attacking here. If they're gonna attack, they might not be able to capture Secrecy this town's right away. Now they do have some troops here, I'm not sure what they're doing with it. They're only at war with Epe Euros, as far as I know. And they don't think they want or they are willing to attack them. Right, so let's go on with the next nice turn. Let's see what's gonna happen next. less and less money because we're recruiting the wrong troops. And we are finally able to arrive here with this spy. Masalia is still a town that has been so often attacked by the barbarians, by Arverni and Edui and so on, but we're gonna make it, we're gonna take it, there will be no problem there. So I think I could already get an army to attack Masalia. Right, this is gonna be more than enough. Actually, let's recruit some more troops though. be one thing. The next thing... This just seem to be... extremely expensive here. Anyway, let's build it. And let's see where this can recruit... Or could we recruit some troops maybe in Rome? a lot, but it's going to be important to have an army all the time. I'm going to get them, give them some troops from here, although it's going to take some, yeah, soon we're going to be able to recruit some units here in uh, Suggesta too. And we're already having a lot of armies, I have to say, one here, one here, very small one, of course, but it's still okay. have a lot of troops here, but it doesn't matter, we're gonna take them and gonna break it now. So let's go on. Oh, they are besieging it again. It's not gonna work. Anymore. 
I hope they're not gonna take it. If they're gonna take it, we're gonna take it anyway. Masada need to be ours. It's a very, very important town. Okay, they have been defeated again. <laughs> I just wonder how they managed to attack it like that from the first strike. I don't get it. Let's see. Now they have less and less troops, but their units have gained even more experience and now they are more fierce. I'm not sure how they managed to attack it like that right away. Really? Just so strange. Whatever. Let's send our troops forward. I know we're gonna have less troops here. Doesn't matter. So we're gonna attack Massalia with this army and I think we're gonna definitely take it. That's what we got here. Yeah, and in the meantime, we should put up a new army here. all our finances to build this okay what do we have here can increase the tax rate a little bit let's go on potential in role this guy gonna go off this army and he gonna have to support it now we have recruited so many troops that we don't have enough finances just yet let's see what the Carthaginians are doing we don't seem to want to take these two towns because if they're not gonna make it, if they're not gonna do it, then I'm gonna have to attack it, take them, take them out. Whatever, let's see what can we build here. We can definitely need bigger increase in population. So let's just go on with these guys here in Nostalgia. We're already having some barbarians here. Doesn't matter, I don't think we're gonna attack. It's true that these barbarians could attack our general here. This is soon gonna attack these guys. Let's see. Let's see what these guys have here. Some cavalry, just they thought, but they have very great defense here. It's not gonna be easy, uh, easy to take them out. There's something more in Taras.
residence of the Algures. That weird because these buildings here are extremely expensive. Except here, of course. So we're already in 259 BC. We have managed to conquer some territory now, I have to say. It doesn't look that bad what we did. What we managed to achieve until now. Everything looks fine. Like I said, so let's already besiege them. This guy should arrive right now. Next time he will arrive and we're gonna make it, we're gonna take it. That's right, we're gonna have enough equipment and so on. We have only just a few units here. It will be taken right away. Of course, this is gonna... Kill many of our units, but it doesn't matter. So the Carthaginians are arriving from the south. I'm not sure what they're trying to... They should, for example, try to take this town of Lusitania right there. Like I said, I'm not quite sure what they are trying to do, but whatever. Let's bring this spy right here. Keep an eye on what's going on here. We are also at war with these guys. That's good. And now let's build up some more things here. This is roads. Yeah, this is also important. We're having a lot of manpower. And let's put up some new troops here. That's it, that would be enough, I guess, right now. General. Time to take this down here. Oh, he's, he cannot move. That's bad. That means that we're gonna have to wait for another turn. Maybe this is gonna deplete some of our units. We can also have more equipment. So we're just gonna wait another turn. And we're gonna attack next turn with this general. It's very limited in movement. Because of the winter. So let's see what else do we have here. This is the infection leader, Knaus Blasio. Let me just right here even more, a little bit of land, some land clearing or whatever. And what do we have here? 4,000 denarii. Group with some more troops in Rome. There is a new building. Which building? So right here, for example. Right, good. Let's go on now. The Carthaginians are arriving. I'm not sure what they're trying to do. Perhaps they're trying to take Massalia. We're gonna see about that. But they're gonna have no chance because we can take it. Plus, these are very poor troops here with this Iberian spearmen. So. Right, I think we could attack. Here. Oh, these are naked fanatics. Oh, average victory. <laughs> I was just certain that this is gonna happen. I have to say. So I think it would be wise to build this stone walls here, although this is gonna be extremely costly, but it's gonna be very efficient. As well. 
this thing right here, and then let's just attack you. The last and last troops. Gonna definitely take them out, but if we're gonna auto resolve it. Yeah, actually, we didn't lose too many men. If I would have fought, we have, would have lost like 100 men perhaps, but like that is what it is. Doesn't matter. Yeah, let's get slave all of them. Let's see if we can actually recruit some manpower here, some troops. No, we cannot, and unfortunately, many buildings are completely destroyed. Um, what is this? Hellenic Light Free Polis. No, let's actually destroy it. I think we're gonna build some building my own. Gonna have to repair everything. It just seems to be so expensive. Whatever it does matter. Alright, this is what it was. Now I'm gonna try not to attack these guys first. I'm just gonna try to take this town of Tolos up here, which in my opinion I think is very important as well. And then I'm gonna try to attack them either at their capital or right here. I know these guys are very neat tribe. They are having three towns. They have their capital here in Turgovia, and this small town. They have another town here in Eastern France, Eastern Gallic region, and Western Germany. Now we have lots of troops here. The general was almost dead. He's about to die. But it's okay. Right, so now let's see. What can we still expand and build? Medicus, I think, is going to be very important. Yeah. Right, so that would be it. Let's go on. I'm going to put up a new army here. Take some troops from the north, and then just keep advancing. And we could actually also take Emporion. But I'm not just gonna take it yet, I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Right, so what can we do with Massalia? I think I'm gonna make it a Romanized province, but not just yet. I'm gonna wait a little bit. First of all, I wanna build these things here. We have to increase the population, money, and everything. Tavim is also a very rich region, as far as I can see. Let's increase the public health here. Yeah, let's put the roads here. That would be it this turn. Like I said, I'm gonna soon try to put up a new army and attack in Tolosa, then I'm gonna go toward Jerkovia or this town, and then I'm gonna take Emporium. I'm just gonna try to expand in France very slowly and carefully, but just expand. Now, this building is not gonna bring us anything, so I'm not gonna build it. I'm sure it's gonna bring just nothing. It's useless. And the Carthaginians were still alive with the Carthaginians, but they uh, seem that they are not willing to expand right now. They're just consolidating their empire, and the Eperos, which have so many enemies, are also not attacking us just yet, which is okay, in my opinion. Now, here we have some roads being built, which can provide us with a lot of trade income, say the least. Okay, so let's go on with the game. Let's see what's gonna happen next.
6,000 income. This is really good. Right, let's put up some new troops. And next turn, we're gonna merging the army. We're gonna attack even farther. We've just inv invested in these towns here at the border. But I think we should just invest also more in our central towns here. Although I know it's gonna be very expensive for us, but we're just gonna have to do it. Right, so let's go on with the game. Oh, again, 6,000. Right, so let's put up a new army. Unfortunately, no general. But it's still okay. Let's put up a new building here in Rome if we can. It's gonna be okay. And we also okay good. So we're assembling a new army here. So we can actually send some more troops. No, oh, these guys are not able, but I'm just gonna send them later. So just send some new troops in here in Bologna. Anyway, it could more, but not just yet, it's not a case now. We're actually, I think, doing perfect here. And with this army, like I said, we're gonna try to attack right here. Then, I'm gonna try to take either... Although, I think Cherkovia should be taken with two armies, because... They are having... What do they have here? Although, they are level pyramid, they are very poor here. But, I still should take it with two armies, because I think that it's gonna be very difficult anyway. So, let's go on with the game. Carthaginians are just keep patrolling here with their troops. I just have the feeling that very soon we're gonna be at war with them. We'll see about that. I know, I have to say that expanding into gold is gonna also be very difficult. I'm just gonna have to be careful. Now I have a new general here that I'm gonna send it right away on a battlefront. Send these troops in. This is a build something new in Capua, such as or something that would not be that expensive. I would say, yeah, this mercantile uh, port is going to be very important. Yeah, I also think that we are just starting to have a lot of money here. Let's see, with these guys we can advance anyway. Forward! Out of move, sir! Imperator! Sir! Now we have two Triaria units, so it's gonna be an invisible army. General. I'm gonna send these guys also in the north. Onward! And yeah, let's just build some more important things such as this port here. We could also build some other troops, such as, although we do have a lot of population, population growth. Um, so we could just recruit some of these units, especially these swap lines, which I think are very important, but not just yet, and do it next time. So let's go on the game.
Right. Increase the tax rate. So what can we do here? I think we're gonna build a Romani Roman ally state here. Because I just like it. So we could make use of all the available units there. And inc including recruiting some generals. Right, so let's just keep going. Six thousand. That's this is still okay. This is what can we build here? We can build a market and this port that we actually don't need right now. This two foreign enterprises and yeah, let's increase the public order. Also recruit some men, but we're just gonna wait until the population is gonna be bigger. Right, so I think that uh, expansion continues very well. Now we're going to do some generals, which are of course extremely expensive, but they are still useful. Let's increase the army here, because all the troops I'm going to send in in the west will be replenished here in Massalia. So let's increase the army potential here with a lot of troops. And oh my god, look at these guys here. I'm, I, I'm not just going to attack them. Just gonna wait for them to attack if they want to attack. But nothing happened here lately. Okay, let's go on. Oh, I'm not sure where they are going, the Arveni. I think they are trying to attack a town in. Southwestern France, the uh, Bordeaux or something. That's okay with me. Now they also have so many units. In order to take Jerkovia, I think I'm gonna have to take with like two armies. Anyway, so I'm just gonna have to end the recording here. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe and watch the next episode to see what's gonna happen. Until then, bye bye.